He basically compared that shit, that shit to an impossible burger. <laughs> Called that shit impossible pussy. Bro. Yeah. Oh my God. Hey, bro, when I said that shit was so funny, bro. Oh my God. Said it wasn't blood, it's beet juice. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. 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 Nah, the one that had me dead, he was like, the dude yeah, came up bro. to him on the street. He was like, they coming for you. Oh, oh, he, oh. Was, he was like, one day or many <laughs> days. Get to the money and slide. Get to the money and slide. Free all the bros inside. Free all the bros inside. Play with the bros, you die. Huh. Yeah. Get to the money and slide. Huh. Free all the bros inside. Huh. Play with the bros, you die. Huh. Yeah. Hey, man. Say, man. It's the Guy 15 Podcast. Coming back, man. Volume 2, man. Part who knows. Got a special guest to my left, man. Go and shout yourself out, my boy. What's up, y'all? It's Kyle again. Um, check out my personal Instagram page at Who Is Kyle, and then check out my clothing brand, Xavier Cohen Official. Man, make sure I go check his shit out, bro. Um, before we get into, how long you been making clothes, bro? Uh, since February. Since February. Okay, what made you want to get into that? Um, I just really been into like fashion brands and fashion and stuff like that, and then I just wanted to do my own twist because a lot of people they just you know what I'm saying, they don't. They're not really passionate about it. Yeah. So I just kind of want to put a lot of emphasis on, like, the garment and the quality of the garment. So. Yeah. I feel like a lot of people, like, they'll have a brand or a symbol, get a T-shirt, just put it on there. That's really it. That's yeah. how they yeah. feel. A lot of people don't really know Shit. a lot about fashion. At us, bro. I mean, yeah. At okay, me next I mean, time. Yeah. But, I mean, but we are podcast. Yeah, we're <laughs> right. yeah. I, I did the same thing, though. Yeah, I just did? put my name on there, but I got another one, like the Hank Aaron shirt. Okay, so. okay. Yeah, but see, our, ours ours is simple, and it costs $15. Yeah, and so make bro. sure y'all go cop the merch, you know what I'm <laughs> saying, sure. at guy15entertainment.com. Sure. But um, <laughs> so all of us, did we all see the Dave Chappelle show? Um, special on Netflix or whatever. Or my, my bad. Straight I'm tweaking. Bro. I'm tweaking. Just to get straight to it. Yeah, we all see that. Yeah, yeah. You know he. And it, it be so funny, but he try to act like like we were like a real show. Nigga said, "Did y'all all see this?" <laughs> like you know, we just said that shit. All right, Come bro. on, what you want to say about it, man? How you? How you? Well, all right, all right. Rate that shit one out of ten. One out of ten. I give it. I give it an eight and a half. I okay. give it an eight and a half. Um, I think his one that was called Sticks and Stones. I think that yeah. was funnier. But this one, it had a, it had a pretty good message on yeah. it. Yeah. See, and that this one was less about being over the top funny, like as in some common day Chappelle yeah. shit. This that is not still nigga. funny as hell. Though. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's yes. like on some nice shit. Yeah. I'm going at y'all. Not going at y'all head, but I'm going at y'all head at the same yeah. time, bro. Yeah. I'm going that nigga He's just showing them, look, I'm Dave Chappelle. I'm going to say whatever the fuck I want to say, yes, basically. Sir. But he does it so smart. And, bro, uh, yeah, niggas talented he's prolific, as fuck. bro. Mm-hmm. And see, but I think the part I love about it, too, is like, all right, so seeing Sticks and Stones, right? I seen that shit. And then he, that's the one where he was wearing, like, the, the prison type fit. like Oh, the green one? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Green yeah, 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 yeah. Green yeah. I, I was, like, I was, I was yeah, wondering what he was wearing in that shit. I'm like, bro, what is this nigga wearing? <laughs> Dave Chappelle. Yeah, Dave Chappelle, bro. Yeah, some Alex McQueen's, too. Damn. I just peeped that. Bit. Yo, yo, you know, yeah. peep the drip, bro. Yeah, yeah. He on some low key shit, but it's funny, bro. Like, if you saw some someone like Dave Chappelle out in public, you wouldn't think he got money, but I know he got. I know he bread, got money. Bro. Yeah. Stupid bread. Hey, so, yeah. bro, boom. So, nigga, then he went on Joe Rogan and was just talking about like just all, like, just everything goes into it. He started talking for like two, three hours type shit, mm-hmm. and it, it's cool seeing him put out that project. Then you know what I'm saying talk about that shit and then do and then put out this like I definitely can't wait that nigga go back on Joe Rogan bro I gotta see that shit bro. What y'all think? Um, what do y'all think the reason is Netflix it wasn't canceled on the show even though a lot of people was mad about that? Well, it's a few, what you, I'm, I'm gonna let y'all answer first. You know I talk all day. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I, I don't know why Netflix wouldn't pull it. I, I don't think they're pulling it because they know they're still going to get money. People well, that see. bag, yeah. Number one, yes. that bag. They they mm-hmm. can't let the bag just yeah. slip through because they've already produced it. Yeah. So, because yeah. they knew, they they had they watched it before they before the shit course, dropped. Yeah. They knew what the fuck. They see what that nigga said. They was yeah. like, all right, well, fuck it. Yeah. Number one, and then number two, bro, it's like, I see what they said in their little, in their little statement. I don't, I don't know if you want to try and pull this shit up real quick while, while I paraphrase that shit, bro. But it was like, basically... They have a whole bunch of other like LGBTQ and shit type shows on Netflix. So like, so nigga, yeah. Yeah, everybody has their own chance, their own platform to do that shit. They're like mm-hmm. number two, nigga. Dave Chappelle is one of the greatest comedians of all of all time. Like, yeah. if he wants to talk about trans people, bro, what are we gonna do? That, that, that that's basically that's basically what they what they had said. Yeah. Bro. People are wondering why he wasn't getting canceled for what he was saying. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, you can't really you can't you can't you can't cancel him when his when his audience exp- that, that's what we want from that yeah. nigga, bro. So like we want him to go because, and I seen this shit um on the Flagrant Two podcast. They, they were saying how he's going after one of the only protected groups type shit. Like the LGBTQ niggas, them them the only niggas you can't talk shit about. 
you can talk shit about black people, bro, <laughs> white people, retarded yeah. people, disabled people, anybody, bro, other than LGBTQ, yeah. bro. You cannot. Yeah. He said it in the. He said it in the special. Yeah. He's like, bro. He like, I ain't got no problems with nobody but white people. That's like, that's, <laughs> what he, that's, that's like, like he don't give a fuck, bro. And bro, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. All right, what was y'all? I don't know if y'all did y'all remember any any specific jokes, bro. Um. Like y'all saying the star when he was talking yeah, about the urinal, the, the urinal, urinal shit, shit, bro. That, shit that funny, nigga is so yeah. funny, bro. My <laughs> shit was that, that nigga. He was talking about he. he all right, now nah, y'all gotta remember. This, that days, I'm, I'm paraphrasing. Yeah, it's this days, days said this had shit. nothing to do with us, bro. But he was like, bro, when when the guys go in there and flip the, you know, what I'm saying flip the goddamn thing inside, I'll get the operation and shit. He was like, wait, why wait, would, what? He don't know how it works. That was sad. Okay, Wait, bro. You say? Okay, so you know when a, when a guy goes to get a sex change operation, oh, they say okay. they, they I think, I think flip it inside out. Still, I'm like, yo, what? nah, they flip <laughs> it inside don't, out don't and, it. And, and tuck it in tight. All right, all right, for sure. Oh, wow. So they, yeah, yeah. So this, so this nigga, he basically compared that shit, that shit to an Impossible Burger. <laughs> called that shit Impossible Pussy. Bro. Yeah, oh my god, <laughs> bro. When I said that shit was so funny, bro. Oh my god, said it wasn't blood, it's beet juice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, nah. The one that had me dead, he was like the dude came up to him on the street. He was like, "They coming for you." Oh, oh, he, oh. Was, he was like, "One day or many <laughs> days." Many days. I was crying, dead, bro. bro. bro and, and it's like, bro, Dave Chappelle saying shit that, that most everyday niggas won't don't yeah. can't say. Yeah, yeah. That, that really what it is, bro. Not, not gonna lie, like we ain't had the thoughts before, but we would never say nothing like that, bro. Because he can, he can do that. We can't <laughs> yeah, do that. Yeah, nigga get away with it, bro. Exactly. And he's doing it on stage and his performance. Yeah. He's not just yeah. spewing. I don't know if you can see, bro. That nigga has. Some folks in the crowd, bro, and like it was some, it was some white people in the crowd. Mm-hmm. And if you just like pay attention, bro, it's wasn't just, laughing at bro, some shit, bro. I, I peeped. I'm talking, I about, I'm, peeped talking about, I'm talking about straight. I know we're all not thinking of the same. It, it was like a white lady with, with the white, hair. With the yeah, 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 it was. Her, she bro. was not playing, nigga. She, she was she not was amused. She, she was, was just sitting amused. there. But I mean, I feel like I you, mean, no offense, but if you're a white person going to a Dave Chappelle show, you should already know what's going on. Yes, like you should already know he's going to say something disrespectful. Like nah, she she towards you, damn things, there. but. Yeah, yeah, but like, I mean, trans shit, she was yeah, not eventually, she was not eventually, going. if you're not hard body, he gonna touch your feelings, bro. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. you're like, like, like going to any comedian and then sitting close, you're taking a risk, yeah, of getting cooked on, like, yeah, <laughs> or, or getting offended or something, bro. But I mean, look, bro, I, I fuck with, I fuck with Dave Chappelle doing what the fuck he want to do, bro, because mm-hmm. like, nigga. It, if he not gonna do it, if Dave Chappelle can't do it, then who can? Who can, yeah. bro? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. he letting it. He's he he letting everybody else know. Look, hey, bro, y'all really don't gotta worry about these motherfuckers, bro. Yeah, y'all can st- as long as you're, you know, what I'm saying, in the context of a joke, you like. And 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 he literally said that. And isn't it that's crazy? He literally said, bro, I don't look at y'all niggas as less than equal or nothing like that. Mm-hmm. I look at y'all yeah. as different than what than than a woman. Yeah, like yeah. that's that's all. Bro, I can see if he said. Oh no, nah, y'all are y'all are beneath humans. Okay, yeah. Yeah. all right, punching nigga. down. Yeah, yeah, that's what he said. Punching <laughs> down. He's like, nigga, how how can I punch down to you? First of all, if I'm not above you, yeah, yeah. that that's the main thing. Like, yeah, and made a great one, point. One with that point, shit. y'all, like he said, gay people and black people are both minorities, and what sometimes he said, I think he was referring to white gay people. That white gay people. They're um they're a minority when it comes when it's time mm-hmm. to be a minority, but when it's time to call the police, they're yeah. they're no Caucasian. Lo- exactly. No, I ain't gonna shit. I'm irrelevant from my sexuality. I'm white. Let's can you come <laughs> quickly, he was please? Like, he was like, at the end of the day, I know a, a black gay person gonna call the cops on me, bro. And and I just don't I, I just don't understand why everybody is so upset, bro. I really don't get it. Yeah, they just like to be mad. I really I really don't get it because like if then because then here's my thing. If a if a white comedian, I mean yeah yeah. A white comedian goes up on stage, starts cooking black people. Are they gonna be mad? Yeah, but at the end of the day, it's comedy, nigga. You can't. Yeah. Yes. He does, like that. If that's his, if that's his shit, and if his audience like that shit, yeah. there's nothing that we can do. You can be mm-hmm. upset. You have your right to be in your feelings or whatever, nigga. You're not. Why are you trying to cancel this? Yeah, yeah. that's my literally thing. to make jokes, like to make just funny. be sensitive. I'm saying, but yeah. mad sensitive, bro. I, mean, I think it's really just this generation, bro. People like canceling people, bro. For what? Like they have that. The, they like to have that that little power, bro. They don't. But Dave Chappelle's not one of them people, though. You can't do that to him, bro. But they always let him back after they cancel. Of course. Yeah. Like how they, how about how they're about to do the baby too? Because they be un, cause then they be like, oh shit, I'm bored. <laughs> well, she'll come on back on and and, Facts. and do some more fuck shit so I can get mad again. Facts. Or the baby drops some just a fire ass song. They're gonna play that shit. Yeah, bro. bro, don't matter, bro. They're gonna listen to that shit. And then I th- I'm glad he brought up the fact that he shot somebody in Walmart, killed somebody, and that's not a big deal it's compared irrelevant. to what he said. It's irrelevant. Yeah. And he talks about that in his songs. They like they like seeing black people kill black people. 
But when black people talk about the other communities, that's when the problems come. Nah, not the other communities, bro. It's just the... It's just, it's just that just one, one specific community, bro. <laughs> hey, I fuck with my nigga Dave Chappelle, bro. He not my nigga, bro. <laughs> hey, bro, I fuck with Dave Chappelle, bro. He said, don't no abort the baby. <laughs> yeah. But nah, like... <laughs> I think the wildest thing to me, bro, like, he was talking about, you know, he had a uh, transgender friend, right? right. He was yeah. talking about that, telling the story, joking, oh, and then oh, he was just like... Then he killed himself. Oh, bro, that shit. Oh. I'm like, what? And like, he's low key shit. laughing as he says this, but he's so dead ass. So dead ass. Like, nah, that that last joke he said about that, bro. That shit was so funny. What he said, bro? That nigga said, he said, I was talking to, I was talking to her, her uh, daughter, bro. He said, oh, yeah, oh. I knew your father. <laughs> <laughs> he was a wonderful woman, bro. That, yeah. that shit had me weak. <laughs> Every week, cause it's like it was funny, bro. But then I was also thinking, I'm like, yo, so dark. I'm That's like, wild. yo. They're gonna be tight after this one, cause like I seen a lot of like you know, quote unquote buzz around that shit. I see people when you're reacting to it and shit, yeah. and so I didn't want to watch any of those reactions until I watched the special. Yeah, and then that's um something that people were saying too. Like folks on Twitter is commenting because like all they're seeing is the clips, bro. If you go if you gonna sit here and argue with somebody for an hour on Twitter. You can at least spend the time to watch that shit, bro. Yes, yeah, man. And actually see the tone of what he's saying and see how he's doing it. People don't want to be educated. They just want to fucking get their little two cents out. That's all it is. I just can't understand that ideology, though, bro. See, look, watching the special, you really see how educated Dave Chappelle is about the community. Like, he he makes a lot of jokes, and it's it's terrible. Like, it's not good jokes. I mean, they're good jokes, but I'm talking about, like... Just something a regular person should yeah, not yeah, say. Yeah, yeah, they're not. Still funny though. Yeah, would not still say, funny. I would say. But I it's like you can tell he's educated as fuck. What? No, I, was, I don't think it's something. I don't think he was saying people to something. I don't think he was saying things that people should not say. I think he was saying things that people would not say. No, like, it's definitely things you should not say. As far as what? <laughs> you shouldn't tell somebody's daughter. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, yeah, There's definitely things you shouldn't say. You shouldn't say but. So, I mean, so what? So what should, he, what should he have told us? Nothing. So it's just, yeah, okay, just okay, don't okay. mention it. <laughs> <I'm insane. laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't want to. I have no idea what you say there, bro. That's just hilarious, but they're really upset. <laughs> and I think Dave Chappelle, because then he was talking about how he lives in Ohio. I think he realized he was like, hold on, bro, this shit is fake. This, yeah. so, this, this shit is this shit is not real. Like mm-hmm. I can really just live my life normally. Mm-hmm. And he was like, people are always saying this and that, bashing him on Twitter. But he was like, hold on, Twitter yeah. is not yeah, a real not place. Real, yeah. bro. It's not a real place, bro. The, oh, like. And that's the thing about cyberbullying. I be saying it's like close that shit. You well, can I mean, literally turn that shit off. That but I feel like people be getting cyberbullied and it leads into getting yeah, bullied in school. And then you're actually in school. Okay, then you're that's, not gonna get cyberbullied by somebody bullying. across the country. I feel like you that's cyber, that's, cyber that's a lot. No, no, I feel like that's the majority of that shit. Motherfuckers, ran, random trolls online and shit make people kill themselves. No little England kid. Nah, I don't know about <laughs> random. It be it be like kids at your school, at their school that's Bro, like bashing them online. I'm not disagreeing with that. There's also be mad cases of random people, like random trolls and shit online. Like the same way. All right, when AJ had all them niggas in it hating in the comments. Yeah. Let's say let's say AJ would have killed himself. Right. That wouldn't have been a crazy uncommon story because of random trolls online. True or false. Mm. None of them niggas really knew AJ. No, but I feel like that shit happens. Same thing, like hella, hella. But that's a lot. Like that's a lot. I feel like cyberbullying is more of like, I don't know. I don't think the majority of kids are getting bullied by like the mass like that. Like AJ was getting it bad from bro, a lot of people. That shit was bad, bro. They was on that nigga neck. Yeah, bro. It was on mm-hmm. Rohead too, though. What they say about Ro? Remember, bro. The, 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 well. They was on roll head saying that his shit was the bare minimum, bro. Oh yeah, for what were we talking about, bro? Oh, he said some good shit, and there was still a lot they of shit. Yeah, that nigga it neck, matter, bro. 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 What did he say, bro? He said, "I think we were talking about what would you do if you had a gay son." Yeah, yeah. bro. What and you? he was just like, "Um, I would treat him with love, and I would, you know, what I'm saying, understand his decision." Like, he, the nigga literally said, "I wouldn't disown him and shit." Like, I was like, and he was saying yeah. like, because people definitely. I definitely remember when niggas used to say that shit a yeah, lot. They were yeah. like, yeah, if I had a good kid, not keeping him. He's gone. I'm killing him. Or I'm telling him to get out of the house or something like that. <laughs> I've definitely heard that shit. And then he said, nigga, I'm not doing that. Got can't. Anyways, but they, they be on. <laughs> and, but that's what, that's what they should be talking about, though. Yeah. That's, that's literally what he's talking about, bro. And, and, and we know that shit, even as small content creators, like, we can't produce shit and be talking shit on them on on them like that. You got mm-hmm. to be real. Because when we post videos on TikTok about the LGBT community, bro. The comment section is not. Oh, it's don't forget the Q, bro. The I said I said Q, right? I thought I did. LGBTQ. Do you have to say uh, the, the Q too? Can can the Q not be just like understood? I mean, you're just gonna make the Qs mad. 
I mean, I mean, what about the the Q I I plus A and all the other shit too? There's Those more. Normally, in yeah, there. it's, it's yeah, LGBTQ it's 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 plus. LGBTQ plus. What? No, you got the I and the A in there too, bro. That's the plus. What is the, the I? Is like plus, plus the, more. Oh, yeah. Okay. Y'all know what the I stands for? No. Probably like intra, <laughs> inner, or some shit. I don't know. Who and knows? You said bro. there's an A too. Y'all know the A. I think A is the asexual. Yeah, that, that's the only thing that makes Who sense. Who knows, bro? I mean, the internet knows. Who knows? Okay, I mean the internet knows, of course. What does the I stand for and L G. <laughs> That's a whole list. You could be here all day. Um, bro, oh, I don't even say God. that, bro. I don't even. Oh, intersex, intersex. Oh, the hell is that? That's what what I, I said. That, bro. I said I inter. Hear. I said, I said, I said, I said <laughs> inter or, or intra or something. You didn't say intersex though. <laughs> With that being said, man, it's been a Gotham Team podcast. Oh yeah, man, peace. <laughs> Get to the money and slide. Get to the money and slide. Free Appreciate y'all coming out to the podcast. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell, man. Check us out on Patreon. Only five dollars a month. Hella exclusive content, man. Follow us on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. Make sure y'all already know you're on YouTube, man. And y'all check out our merch. Link is in the bio. We out, man. Peace.